Hello America, this is Keith, your friendly neighborhood technician, come back at you with some more wonderful information. Today we're going to go over why isn't my ice maker making ice anymore in my fridge. Well, we're going to go over some of the more popular ones like the French door, so we're going to use a whirlpool here. Now, if you look at it, yes, y'all, you know, you go bang, bang, ice comes out, motor turns on. That's, we're not going to go over that. Right now we're looking at the ice compartment area, okay? This on the Whirlpool is usually up in this corner, or it might be a little bit different. There's a couple different designs, but for the most part, this is the one we're going after. Basically, what you want to do is, there's a button here you push, and this will come out, okay? Don't worry really about that, that's just your ice tray. What we're worried about is actually in here, okay? Now, if we look at this, this area has to be 10 degrees or lower. If you're above 10 degrees, the machine is not going to function, okay? Yes, I know the ice won't melt, nothing along those lines, but if it's below, if it's above 10 degrees, the ice won't make. It's a manufacturer design issue, can't, don't know about that, that's not my business. But what you also wanna look for is, you see this little bar here? If this is stuck up, okay, that means your ice machine is shut off. So you wanna find out what's holding that up. If that's stuck up, you're not gonna make any ice, even if it is a proper temperature along those lines. Those are a couple things you wanna worry about and find out you may have to put a thermometer inside your ice bucket put it back in there let it sit for a little bit to find out what your temperature for your ice machine room is okay if it's above 10 degrees you've got a cooling problem that's a whole different issue okay but don't forget to subscribe and like this youtube channel I'll come back for more wonderful information later